a relative of mine used to say, you're not making a hard enough dua. Make it big, make it hard. Meaning hard meaning, not as in difficult, but hard meaning it must be solid. Solid dua, oh Allah. You know, when I was young, this was always something very, very funny. We used to enter the masjid as little boys and we used to see uncles in the front sitting, you know, mashallah. And, and they used to sit, some of them dedicated, some of them were all chairman. You know, everyone wants to be a chairman. And when I was young, I used to think, they say, he's the chairman. And I used to see him sitting on a chair. And I thought, okay, maybe that's... Then I see, but, but dad, aren't all these other ones chairman as well? They're all sitting on the chairs. No, those are just people who are perhaps not able to stand. Oh, then we understood. Otherwise, I used to call them chairman. <laughs> so we enter the masjid, we see all the chairmen, mashallah. And at the same time, we're sitting at the back and we see them making dua. Now, you know, just before Maghrib, sometimes they raise their hands and making dua to Allah. Then you see someone, oh Allah, grant me. Oh Allah, help me. And you say, wow, this man is crying. And look at his hands, he's asking Allah. And suddenly in the one corner, you say, oh Allah, help me. Allah and say hey hey this man has a big problem can you see how he's calling Allah yeah, Allah, Allah. <laughs> but to be honest that's his way of calling out to Allah the Prophet sallallahu raised his hands so high that you could see the whiteness of his subhanallah subhanallah you could see the whiteness close to his armpit that's how high he raised his hands. What about us? We call out to Allah. Do we really call out? Or it's just in passing. Everything's smooth for us. My brothers and sisters, prepare for the day when you're about, when you're going to leave this world. Prepare, prepare for that day.